When I heard the news and the war had started in Ukraine, one of the first things that happened was I went to my church and I said, where do you guys need the most help? And they said, we're getting a lot of donations. People are calling our church saying, we want to help the Ukrainians. We have nowhere to put this stuff. One of the big partners we've had locally is the Rotary Club, and it's a group of individuals who are there to help. When that community started working together, a huge amount of stuff was flooding in, and we were giving an opportunity for refugees with nothing to come to the warehouse and receive help. They were getting clothes, they were getting canned goods, people that got housing were able to get couches and beds, and anything that wasn't taken locally and distributed with the local refugees, we put on containers and shipped it to Ukraine. My main reason to do this is just to help people to stand up. These people are hard workers, they're open-hearted. Most of them, they come with nothing, but they have a good background. They had businesses up there, they had a lot of stuff up there that they left behind because of the war. Живя в Україні, в городі Маріуполь, ми займалися з мужем своїм ділом любимим. Це було наше кафе. От нього залишився один пепел. По приїзду сюди нам допомогли Rotary Club Сан Марко, чому я теж дуже благодарна їм. Спасибо їм велике. I could just go on and on and on as far as of the people opening their hearts and their minds and also as far as giving whatever type of support that's needed. I just take my hat off to this community. We are people of action. The American ethos is that of taking in and welcoming. At my core, I believe that every single immigrant has a place if they want to be part of this community. Be a welcomer. Be a welcomer. Be a welcomer. Be a welcomer. Be a welcomer.